watching Dave's TV. And now today, in his man cave. Take it away, Dave. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Dave from Dave's TV. Welcome to the channel and welcome to the creepy man cave. And we have another beer that we're going to do for the spirit of Halloween, fall, whatever you want to call it. It's an IPA, our IPA's holiday theme. Well, sure they are when they're on New Belgium Voodoo Ranger and they got the skull skeleton guy on there. And this is a new one. I've got a variety pack. Two of them I've already done. The other two, which is one of these that I have not done, kind of new. This is called Haze Glare IPA from their Voodoo Ranger series. And this is a 7.7% ABV, so it's up there. And I don't, that's all they have on the can. And I'm assuming it's good to January 4th, 2024. So it doesn't seem to be that old. And yeah, it's just a Haze Glare IPA. I didn't do my homework on this. So I'll put everything like I always do in the description below. So let's get to it. Smells very good. I can smell it from here. Um, definitely a haze IPA. I see a little bit of light coming through, but not much. I can see the carbonation going up. Um, kind of a light yellow color. Beautiful white head on it, and the head staying strong on it. Um, let's put a nose on it. Hmm. Sinus problems. I hate that. Definitely tropical. Definitely fruity. I'm not, for once in my life, I can't tell you what fruit it is. Citrus is in there for sure. Orange. I'm saying passion fruit. Dude, that is really hazy when you don't have the light up to it. Orange and passion fruit. Maybe a hint of pineapple, mango. That's about it. it. Smells sweet. Not saying it's going to be sweet, but it smells like it. And the head, man, that thing's got, boy, definitely got some good head on there. That's what she said. A little dry humor there. So. Take a taste. Tired of talking about it. Tired of sniffing it. Cheers. One more. The first taste I get is like an orange flavor. I'm not sure what type of orange. Um, picking up on the pineapple. Passion fruit, what it tastes like. Um, a little, a real sweet sweetness to it, not a whole lot. Definitely the bitterness on the back end. I'm going to say anywhere from 50 to 60 IBUs. If it's listed, I'll put it in the description below. Um, not a bad uh, hazy IPA. You didn't see that. Wow. Hold on. <clears throat> Messing up my new table, man. What the heck? Thank God it's got polyurethane on there. Keep it from soaking in. Back to the beer review. <clears throat> yeah, I like this one. 
Is it the best Voodoo Ranger? No. Would I buy this again? Yes. Would I drink it again? Yes. Two thumbs up. You're picking up on the orange, pineapple, some mango, passion fruit. And I on that last sip, I think I got some guava in there. So you're getting all kinds of tropicalness on here. I like it. It's not bad. You don't even taste the alcohol. Um, it's there, but you barely taste it. Like I said, two thumbs up. I bought this from ABC Fine Wine and Liquor. Oh, excuse me. Stan Correction, Win Dixie Grocery Store. And uh, not bad. There's another one in there I'm going to try out sometime. Um, but with that being said, if you would hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, let me know what your thoughts are on Haze Glare IPA. That is what it looks like. Now, let me know what your thoughts are. Share it on all your social media. Until the next time, drink responsibly. Please don't drink and drive. Cheers, everyone. Two thumbs up. We'll see you next time.